Dave Cervini with Garage Gurus. Today I want to talk about diagnosing carbon buildup on GDI fuel systems. Some of the symptoms you may have with carbon buildup on your intake valve is uh, poor idle quality, poor fuel economy, a check engine light might come on, uh, just poor performance all the way around. So what happens is with a GDI system, the fuel is delivered differently than an earlier common fuel system. On a GDI system, the fuel is sprayed on the, into the cylinder itself, and an earlier common system, say like a multi-port system, it's sprayed on the back of the intake, intake valve, which washes off carbon off the valve. Oil deposits get on this valve because of the PCV system in the vehicle. We'll talk about that a little bit later. So this could happen as early as 20,000 miles on a vehicle. This vehicle has about 100,000 miles on it. So we're going to inspect this with a borescope. Uh, so you don't have to disassemble the engine. So the bore scope that I have here, purchased it online. It's about a $30, $40 bore scope, Bluetooth to my phone. Works pretty well. So we're going to go in through the intake valve. Key was off, opened up the throttle body. And we're going to insert it into the intake manifold here. And it may take a while to get to where you need to be. And you'll start identifying the valves. So like I said, it may take a while to find out where the valve is. So we have the camera inside the intake manifold. We're looking at the back of the intake valve. You can see the carbon buildup and the other buildup around inside that combustion chamber. What happens is the PCV system, positive crankcase ventilation, back pressures from the crankcase blow back into the intake. It's a emission control system. What it does, it goes into the intake valve. You can see it right here. You can see the buildup. The fuel is no longer delivered into the back of that intake valve with the GDI systems. So what happens is this becomes hardened, gets cooked, baked, um, turns into carbon. At this point, this intake manifold has to come off the vehicle and it has to be cleaned. You can use a walnut blaster. Uh, we have videos out on it as far as different methods and way of cleaning it. Once that is cleaned, it has to be reassembled. So customers ask all the time, how can I prevent this? One way to prevent this is uh, a PCV catch can. So basically what that is is a catch can that collects the oil vapors into a canister instead of going into the intake manifold. The other way to prevent this is uh, additives, fuel additives. You can put some in your tank earlier on in the vehicle. Uh, when the mileage is low, there's not a lot of carbon buildup, you are preventing it from carbon buildup. The other method you can use is uh, use quality gas. Use the same uh, filling station consistently. Don't jump around and buy an inexpensive gas. Um, it's all about the detergents in that gas. So those are some of the prevention tips that you can do on the GDI system. For more tech tips like this, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. For more Garage Gurus information, please visit our website, garagegurus.tech.